Hey Cardinal fans, welcome to this week's episode of Bird's Eye View. This weekly show will feature highlights from Cardinal Athletics and preview the week ahead. I'm Noah Finley, let's take a look at this week's action. Football received end of the year honors from both NCCAA, CSC, and the AP. Seager DeGainer and Casey Roush were named to the first team all NCCAA. Will Dowling, Gabe Dowling, Marvitas Dupree, and Alonzo Johnson were named to the second team. Casey Roush was also named to the CSC All-American team as a punter. Seager DeGainer was also named to the AP All-American second team as a return specialist. Bowling's Corey Reichert and Gabriella Van Horn each picked up another WAC Bowler of the Week award over the break following their efforts at the Glenn Carlson and Collegiate Shootout. The teams are back in action this weekend as they travel to the Kegel Collegiate Classic on Saturday and Sunday. Women's basketball went 101 on the week as they picked up a home win against Aquinas on Wednesday before falling to number 13 Indiana Tech on the road. They are back in action this week as they travel to Siena Heights on Wednesday and will host Rochester on Saturday at 1 p.m. Men's basketball picked up a win last Wednesday against Aquinas at home before narrowly falling to number 16 Indiana Tech on Saturday. The Cards are back in action this week with the road game at Siena Heights before they host Rochester at 3 p.m. Men's hockey fell in both games over the weekend to University of Michigan Dearborn. Senior Hunter Keppel broke the program's record for points in a career in their game last Friday. The team returns to the ice with two games against Lawrence Tech when they travel to them on Friday before returning home on Saturday when they have an 8.30 puck drop. Cheer and Dance will host their sole invitational of the season on Friday. The meet will start with cheer teams around 6 p.m. and dance beginning around 7.30 p.m. Women's hockey is back in action this weekend as they will go up against Michigan State on Friday at home with an 8 p.m. puck drop and then again on Sunday when they are back on the road. Track and Field returns this upcoming Friday when they head to SVSU Classic with first event starting around 2.30 p.m. Stay up to date on all your Cardinal news scores and schedule updates at ConcordiaCardinals.com or follow us on social media at CUAA Cardinals. Thanks again for tuning in and go Cards!